Hello guys, my name is Richie and welcome to my channel, Auto Lab Pro Channel, Auto Lab Pro Garage. I'm located here in Matawan, New Jersey, and in this video, I'm going to discuss with you your serpentine belt. Uh, on the car that we're going to discuss, this is going to be a Mercedes E350, it's a 2006, alright? Nice car, uh, one of my favorites. It's V6. 268 horsepower, and in Mercedes Lingo, it's a W211. Zero to 60 in 6.5 seconds, not bad for a V6. Plenty of power there, okay? This is a diagram of your belt routing, okay? Save that in case you wanna put your own belt on. It's exactly what I'm gonna tell you how to do it here. Tools required to change that belt, a 3 8 ratchet, long handle, and a 17 millimeter socket. Now, what does this belt do for you? Why do you need to change it? Okay, first of all, what does it do, right? The belt is used to power your alternator, your water pump, your power steering, and your air conditioner, okay? On this engine, for this car, this is what this belt powers, okay? It's really easy to change. It doesn't take a lot of time and, um, I'm gonna show you where it is. We're gonna, I'm gonna show you that here in a minute. And uh, the, the usual cost for this belt is anywhere between $30 to $50. Uh, depends on who's selling it, okay? Um, so we're gonna go over how to change it. It's really simple and it's quick, okay? That's the car, one of my favorites. I'm gonna show you how to change that belt right now. Thank you. 